going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video. As I read by the title, we are gonna be reviewing the Amazon slash Birkenstock slash clogs slash knockoff slash whatever you want to call it. But I just want to hit y'all with this review because I know it's a lot of y'all out there that's like thinking about looking um, to buy the clogs or the Birkenstocks or whatever. And they're so expensive. Like I went into Spencer's and I got my girlfriend a pair and I dropped $150. And I was just like, it was like, oh babe, you want to twin me? Like you should get some. I said, I am not paying that price. But it looked very intriguing. So I was like, okay, well, let me do some research, you know, and I was doing research, so I was typing in, and what did I stumble upon? This thing right here, this box. It's from TF Star. I got this on Amazon. I paid, I think, like 25 bucks, 30 bucks. So it's a huge difference in pricing, a very huge difference in pricing. I haven't really wore these yet. Like I looked at them, took them out the box. I just got these a couple days ago. Um, I was waiting to, you know, get the right timing to make a video about it so I can give y'all a review on it. Cause I know it's a lot of you guys out there that want the claws, but you don't want to pay the price. So this is a pretty decent alternative. So this is how they look. Comes with regular, you know, standard wrapping paper. But I got the brown pair. My girlfriend got the black. I'll go get hers just so we can compare them. These are the actual Birkenstock uh, clogs right here. As you can see, they are very, you know, Birkenstocky. And let me show you the pair that I got from Amazon. So they look a lot the same, honestly. Like, I can't really tell the difference. As you can see, it has the, has the strap right there. Mine also has the strap right there. You turn it around that side, it has the button. Mine also has the button. This is just a side-by-side. -side. Mine's is a little bit like chunkier in the toe area only because I have a big, way bigger foot than her. But also because, you know, obviously it's $25 compared to $100. The leather is way looser on this one. Like it's very floppy. This one on the other hand is more stiff. Now it might be because I haven't worn them yet. They might loosen up more when I wear them. It's a really good, you know, comparison when you compare them for that much. Like as you can see the little wooden part right there. They look a lot the same. I mean, the inside you have, it says star TF or TF star. And this one says Birkin socks, but who's gonna be looking on the bottom of your shoe? From a distance, you're wearing these. You can't really tell like what's fake and what's real, really. And it's really all about how you style them. Oh, the bottom of the shoe as well. Um, they have pretty much the same design, if not a slight difference. I mean, you, you can't really go wrong with the Amazon version. If you guys are, you know, don't wanna spend all that money, which me personally, I wasn't trying to spend all that money on, on a shoe that I didn't really know if I wanted or not definitely would go this route and get the Amazon pair. No, I'm not sponsored by Amazon, but I am looking for a sponsorship. So Amazon hit me up. Enough talking, I'm gonna give y'all a little on fee review, show y'all how to style these. Also wanna point out, um, when you buy on Amazon, the shipping, it takes around, it says it's like a month long, but it's not really a month long. I ordered these, I wanna say two weeks ago, and it said it wasn't gonna get here until like October, like mid-October, October 13th or something. And these came like a week and a half later. So don't be scared when you go into buy them and it says, you know, they're gonna be a month out. I personally didn't care. I was like, you know, once I get them, I'll get them. Like I wasn't tripping on the, the shipping, but for people who are like, man, I really want these and I want them to come fast. I would say still order them because mine's came like a whole three weeks earlier. So I would definitely wouldn't worry about the shipping. I also want to point out the stitching. It obviously it's not going to be the best quality as y'all can see if you get a super closer look. It's kind of like some, you know, some glue right there that compared to, you know, the Birkenstocks, you know, it's very, um, very well put together. Not a lot of, not a lot of glue um, you can see, but then you compare it to this one, it's like kind of a lot of glue. But I mean, who's really looking? I mean, is it on this one too? Like, it's not really on this one. Like, who's really comparing? Like, look at the similarities, guys. Like, side by side. Like I said, the leather is way more floppier on this one. But I mean, look at this, guys. Like, they're the same thing. So, I would say, get them. Sorry, I'm getting the thumbnail. <laughs> I would say cop. So I'm gonna give you guys an on-fee review and let's get right into it.
wrap up the video right there. So as you guys have it, we have the classic clog Birkenstock knockoff Amazon, AKA way cheaper than the actual ones review. Yeah, guys, go copy you guys a pair. I believe when I checked, they had these in, I think it was a darker brown. It was a gray and a black, but the black was sold out. So I don't know if they were stocked yet, but I, I just like this color just cause I don't know, this is more like a homey color to me and I really like how comforting it looks, especially for fall. I really love this color. Make sure y'all like and subscribe. If y'all enjoyed the video, please like this video and please subscribe. I really love y'all. I appreciate y'all. Stay tuned for the next video, man. And we out.